Hi, in this tutorial, we will learn how to use VLOOKUP in LibreOffice. So first of all, uh, you have to type in the items or things you are searching for. So let's say we are having this inventory item, then we have having SKU ID, another one is the price, and we want to search for mic as well as uh, chair. And uh, we want to know the SKU ID and prices of uh, both of them from this master data. So first of all type VLOOKUP and then press enter. So it doesn't work in this but it works. So if you type formula and press tab it won't work. It works in Excel. So VLOOKUP look up yeah so press enter in this case in the LibreOffice and uh, what, what is the string you are searching for it is mic in this case then the region you want to define and then comma and then SKU ID is in the second column so 2 and then should it be exact match or the absolute match uh, approximate match uh, well it should be exact match so press 0 does it work yes it does and if you type let's say column 3 then it will return the value as well we can just type dollars so that the copying of this particular formula becomes easier and uh, yeah if you'll copy it copy it over here now the value has changed type a14 because we are searching for this but we want the third column value which is this one now 213 so this is correct and uh, since we copied this formula and the absolute uh, addressing is there so we can just pull this down and we can also pull this down so chair chair w e1 and we have the third column which is the price so chair has the price 34 and over here we are also having 34 and if you will just have a fan over here it will give us the exact value which is of fan so kd1 now if you want to use let's say newspaper replace that and we can see the values of SKU ID and price have changed and just in case you want to add it up now now let's say 269 is the sum but if you replace it with let's say mic the sum also change Thanks so much for watching this tutorial. If you liked it, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you didn't, then leave a comment so that we can improve it further. Do watch these suggested tutorials to learn even more. And do let us know what you want to learn on being skilled.